Weather Center. Here is your Storm Team 29 forecast. It's the calm before the windstorm. Hello, I'm Storm Team 29 meteorologist Josh Fitzpatrick. I hope you've had a good Easter Sunday. I have a lot to talk about. Let's get right to it. Here's a look outside live in downtown Charlottesville. The clouds have thickened up so far. It's been on the dry side. And if you notice, if you look outside at those clouds, they're moving pretty fast from southwest to northeast. And some of those winds up in the atmosphere will get transported down to the surface as we head into late tonight and tomorrow morning with very gusty winds. Currently, temperatures are falling from the low 70s into the upper 60s as the clouds thicken up low 60s over into the Shenandoah Valley. NBC 29's exclusive dual pole show put off the radar shows the first band of rain approaching us from the southwest already raining at Lynchburg to Lexington and even outside of any rainfall the winds are going to be gusty late tonight into the day on Monday even outside of any rain or storm. So late tonight and through the day on Monday wind gusts over central Virginia will be up to 55 miles per hour at at least 60 mile per hour wind gusts for the Shenandoah Valley and the Blue Ridge Mountains. That's outside of any rain or storms. With any storm, the wind could be higher than that. So there's rain approaching us from the southwest. It's going to increase from southwest to northeast overnight. Rain heavy at times and the wind will also begin to increase over the next six to eight hours. But the big weather story is an ongoing severe weather outbreak going on right now across the Tennessee Valley over into Alabama and Mississippi. Numerous reports of large tornadoes south of Jackson, Mississippi, and now moving into portions of Alabama. Now, overall, some of that's going to weaken as it moves northeast, but it's, it's heading to the northeast in our general direction for late tonight and tomorrow morning. So future cast shows widespread rain over spreading the area overnight. Stop the clock 3 a.m. The first line, the first squall line will approach from the southwest. Perhaps another batch of heavy rain and storms as we head into the early to mid morning hours 8 a.m. And then after 10 o'clock in the morning, the severe weather threat is going to shift away from us. And afternoon, sunshine breaks out, but the winds will stay on the gusty side right into tomorrow evening. Here's what I'm worried about. Winds in excess of 60 miles per hour through tomorrow and also some localized flooding. Not so much the large hail, but also there could be a few quick spin up tornadoes late tonight into tomorrow morning. But with the gusty winds, there will be some scattered to perhaps widespread power outages east of the Blue Ridge, especially so that that's the, that could be an issue as we head into tomorrow morning. One to three inches of rainfall could cause some local high water as well. So this evening, not so bad. I'm not expecting severe weather. Uh, expect showers to arrive from the southwest. Winds increasing, temperatures steady in the low 60s overnight. Tomorrow morning, severe weather is likely. And then after 10 a.m. to midday, the severe weather threat will exit with temperatures approaching 80 in central Virginia and low 70s for the Shenandoah Valley. Michael and Sun 70 forecast shows us cooler and drier Tuesday, low 60s, and some chilly rain showers Wednesday with highs in the, the uh, lower 50s.